Here in the Waterton Biosphere Reserve, tens of thousands of acres of rancher-managed prairie still transition smoothly into the protected mountains of Waterton Lakes National Park. And the park is an amazing place, but it's small. The elk and the grizzly bears and the wolves, they can't survive in the park on its own. They need area to roam, they need area to fulfill all their habitat needs, and it means moving across the park boundaries. And you hear it said, and it's really true, when you drive into the park, you really don't realize when you've entered the park, the land is contiguous here, which is what makes it so special. People celebrate the Serengeti of Africa, but we had our own special place here in North America. And what we're talking about at the edge of the Rockies is the last half of 1% of it. Where we're sitting right now, if you went east 1,000 miles distant, you're not gonna find the assemblage of wildlife that still exists, that once did exist across the plains, but are here. Cattle have replaced bison, but everything else was here when Columbus arrived is still here. So that makes this a very special place. Thank <laughs> you.